What is up everyone? Welcome back to Whales and Locks. In uh, today's video, we're gonna be looking at Kansas State taking on TCU. Uh, the line in this game is TCU minus four and the over-under is 128 and a half. So this is the third time these two teams will match up as currently the series sits at one apiece. Um, as surprisingly, both teams were winners on the road against each other this season. Um, on the Kansas State side, they sit at eight and 19, four and 14 in the Big 12, putting them in the nine seed here. Uh, Kansas State does kind of sit in a spot here with Iowa State as the clear two worst teams in the Big 12. Um, I'm not sure we could be looking at a worse offensive team in the country here. Um, certainly they are the worst in the off or worst offensive team in the Power 5, no doubt. Uh, they average a mere 61.2 points per game, putting them 388th in the country. Uh, just awful. And in conference play, they're averaging just 59.4 points per game. Um, on the season, these guys shoot just 29.1% from three and 41% from the field. Um, I don't want to rip into these guys too much, though, as they have been playing better of late, winning three of their last four and holding their opponents under 60 <clears throat> in three of those games. Um, so I don't want to get too far ahead here, though, and make it sound like their offense has been improving. It really hasn't. It's just been defense. Um, on the TCU side, they sit at 12 and 13, 5 and 11 in the Big 12, putting them as the eighth seed here in the Big 12 tournament. Uh, TCU has been playing pretty poorly as of late. Uh, losers of six of their last seven, uh, with their sole win coming against Iowa State, who has yet to get a win in the Big 12. Um, on the season, these guys put up just 67.5 points per game, ranking them 296th. And over their last seven games here, they've averaged just 61.6 points per game. Uh, so really a struggle bus for both teams here lately on the offensive side. Kansas State throughout the whole season. Um, and it's really not like over-unders have really adjusted well to either of these teams here. As Kansas State has hit the under in each of their last six games, and in these last six games, they've hit it by an average of 19.8 points. Um, while TCU has hit the under in four of their last seven games here, with one of those overs hitting by just 0.5 points. I think we, I think you get where I'm going with this one. I just think this over under at 128 and a half is a little bit ambitious here. Um, as I just can't see how either team shoots their way close to a mid 60s type of ball game, which is essentially what has to happen for this over to hit. So I do like under 128 and a half here for this game. Uh, to stay in the low 60s and high 50s. So if you did enjoy this content and would like to see more picks in the future, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.